Good day, everyone. Tomorrow is Ash Wednesday, as you know. In the second reading for tomorrow's Mass from 2 Corinthians chapter 5, St. Paul begins by saying, We are ambassadors for Christ, as if God were appealing through us. This one simple statement provides a wonderful Lenten guide for us. First of all, Paul says we are ambassadors for Christ. He doesn't say let's be ambassadors or we should be ambassadors. He is clear and emphatic saying we are ambassadors. Yes, we are through our baptism and the resulting faithful practice of our beliefs. Ambassadors as we know them in our time are the representatives for their country and they live in another country and culture. For them to represent their countries, ambassadors must be extremely knowledgeable of the country they are representing. And more than that, they must love their country because in order to speak of for, defend, and in some sense protect something, you have to love it and embrace its ideals. So being ambassadors for Christ that we are, for us to excel in this responsibility and this gift, we need to know our faith well, believe strongly, and love the Christ who lives in us. Then we can strive to be examples for others. Lent is a wonderful time for us to grow in our ambassadorship, so to speak. We can engage our head by studying an aspect of our faith that we may be a little weak in and we can engage our hearts by letting what we have learned in our faith be put into practice in the service of others. So let's ask God from the very start of Lent to help us to be good ambassadors of Christ by learning more about our faith so that as we practice it, our lives will be lived in loving and serving God and each other. And as they said of the Christians in the early church, hopefully they'll be saying of us, see how these Christians love one another. God bless.